kit this evening. There's been significant changes in play. I worked into space. Chibwe, a 29-year-old who was born in South Africa, but uh, an option here in the form of Lamine Diadu. Diadu taking on Chipeshi and Diadu forced behind for a first corner kick of the game. It goes the way of the visiting nation from. Very tricky, and I'll tell you why. Because he plays on the right and he's left-footed. Yeah. Mel on the eye. Clear to the path of Jean Bocandi. He slipped it through and it's been well left. That was ever to has blasted it over. Bully Samba with the presence of mind. The Afcon winner James. He worked out why by the lines of Taranga. This is Lamin Diadu seeking to make amends for it's a problem from for Luca Chuma, Chamanga. how crucial that midfield is going to be that there is no space at all now worked into space nicely for uh, Diadu and set back the decision making Passy they have equalized but they're more like saying go and DI now We'll have a free kick in a very promising position. Luca Chamanga is the man booked. Confirmed their place in Sunday's final. These two sides battling it out to join them. Zambia have lost just one of their previous 10 semi final. Zambia hustling to win the ball. It's Mumba going about his, uh, his business. He is a tint in the uh, AFCON and World Cup qualifiers. That's how much faith they do have in young Prince Mumba. This time in DI, up against uh, taking the ball. I think there's a Sakala that he used to coach. That there's coached a lot here in South Africa and build out a lot of teams. He was the old, your Dylan Kerr type as a coach. Now Senegal are in behind. Well worked move, nothing wrong with that, well set up. They have both have a, they have a win apiece and four draws. That's not wrapped up yet. They are not assured of a spot against Namibia just yet. Zambia are flying here against the guests Senegal who have brought on Nyanya.